So basically, the game doesn't tell you, but if I. Oh! Oh no. Oh no. I cannot wait to. It's been ages since Constellation has had someone new. I wonder what he's like. I am at your service, Captain. Oops. <laughs> the boom, I go here to surface map. I can fast travel to my ship. It saves a lot of time that way. That's good. It's good to know. Good to know. And from here, I can take off. Beautiful. getting closer to it very slowly this is real and, it, and if you're sitting there thinking wow that's that's really slow it's going to yeah consider just how large a kilometer is you know it in a car it takes about 30 seconds to go a kilometer So I'm pretty sure, yeah, you could physically land here. I don't have the patience for that, but I <laughs> I wouldn't doubt the, the possibility that this is a very real uh, possibility that you could physically fly all the way there. I'm just not mad enough to do it, nor is my ship powerful enough. Maybe it can make it more powerful, but this thing is maxed out right now as far it's got this is as much juice as it will go all right This game is big it's big Also, I saw a complaint online that you can't get out of your ship like like, like you can't get out out of the cockpit while you're in space, uh, yes you can. You most certainly can. And yes, you can also see the ships flying around while you do that. That's a very real thing too. What you reading? Don't look at me like that, weirdo. Now my... So you have the navigation console, right? Um, I am looking to, billet, to visit uh, the system called uh, Cheyenne. I heard this was the cowboy paradise. And this is where I'm going to go to get uh, what I want. I just don't know where the hell I'm going to find it. This is it. It's gonna use up pretty much all of my fuel. Let's do it. Or should I go to Olympus first? Yeah. So yeah. Oh, my house is here.
Sorry, Sarah. We're gonna make a quick stop. Approaching ship, you've entered Free Star Collective Space. Maintain your current course while we scan for contraband. All right, you're good. Welcome to Aquila City. Hmm. And where's the city? Here? Sick. Land! This is supposedly my paradise. Looks like shit out here, it's all dusty! If we're planning on staying a while, we could grab a room at the Stone Root Inn. Yeah? Let's go! Marshal Daniel Blake, I need to inform you, we've got some trouble at Gal Bank. Huh? Folks might be in danger, so you may want to steer clear. What's the trouble? Well, all I know is there was an attempted bank robbery and things went sideways. You'd have to ask the Marshal if you want the whole story. But keep that in mind. If you think you might be able to help out, you could talk to the Marshal. Truth is, last I heard, things weren't going so good. That's a shame. Sam has told me so many stories about Aquila City. <laughs> I feel as though I've lived here all my life. Planning to tell me your demands at some point? You find someone we can trust and maybe we will. Like who? Not you. You're not one of your rangers. And not these city guards, neither. <sighs> Everything will turn out. You need to stand back now. <laughs> What's going on? It's a hostage situation. Now please, get back. Or I'll have the guards drag you away. Sounds like you could use some help. I don't mean to be rude, but I don't know you. I don't know you either. Now please, stand back. Will you at least hear me out? Fine. Talk fast. It's clear you're not getting the job done, so let me try. And what the hell do you know about it? But all right, if you think you can do better, you're sure as hell welcome to try. Some folks from the Shaw Gang tried to rob the place, but they got spotted by a guard. They took everyone inside hostage, and now they're keeping a watch so we can't move against them. They're using the intercom to communicate. Sounds like they got the drop on you pretty good. <laughs> Embarrassing. Well, that's real damn helpful. Thank you. <laughs> they won't talk to me. Say they don't trust the badge. <laughs> they want a neutral negotiator. In other words, they didn't have a plan for this, so they're stalling while they come up with one. Hmm. So what's your plan? Without demands, I ain't got much to work with. About all we can do is wait and see. Well, who's the hostages? The guards? If I could slip it unseen, I could take them out quick. It might come to that. But first, I just want you to talk to them. Just talk to them? Find out what they want, and then report back to me. I sincerely hope you know what you're doing. Hey, you in the bank. I'm sending in a negotiator, so don't shoot. Hands where I can see him, and don't try nothing. Security around here is a joke. 
Uh, you're the negotiator, huh? Yeah. You think you're just gonna walk up here and get us to surrender? You're dead wrong. First, I'd like to know who I'm talking to. What's your name? Uh, it's Jed. Jed Bullet. Hmm. Good to meet you, Jed. I'm Eric. Well, ain't you polite. So tell me, stranger, how do I know you're gonna deal straight with us? Hmm. Because you're not the only one who's had trouble with the law. I heard that. Okay, so let's talk. What's the condition of the hostages? They talk too damn much. Complain about everything. Hmm. Much as we'd like to, none of us has shot one yet. Hmm. Must be something you want. So start talking before I get bored. Got a real attitude. Problem, don't you? Sure. Well, you better listen up. We want to guarantee a safe passage to the spaceport and a ship. We'll drop the hostages off somewhere safe in the system. After that, we'll radio back where they are, and the marshal and his crew can come and get them. But if anybody follows us when we break orbit, we start shooting people. Got it? Hmm, that's a pretty tall order. Then persuade the marshal that it ain't. <sighs> this whole damn job's gone wrong. It was supposed to be just a quick hit. Clean and simple, you know? So let's just... Let's all try to keep our heads, yeah? Because my guys, they're going crazy in here. I don't know how much longer we can last. Hmm. It's not too late to end this peacefully. What do you mean? <clears throat> you might as well let your prisoners go. You think they're keeping you safe, but they're not. Sometimes bad things happen to innocent people. That's life. Hmm. Hmm. If even one hostage dies, your robbery charge becomes a murder charge. You don't want that to happen. It's up to the marshal to make sure the hostages don't get hurt. You let the hostages go. I'm sure the marshal will show you some leniency. Maybe you're right. Nobody gets hurt. Won't have to rot in jail for the rest of our lives. And if even one hostage dies, remember, it's a murder charge. Damn it! I didn't think of it that way. What if the hostages have families? You really want to deprive children of their parents? Where they are. Nah, it's too late to back out now. We're seeing this through. You go tell the marshal to get that ship ready so we can all walk away from this thing without anybody getting hurt. So that's how it's gonna be, huh? Marshal? Those guys are scared. I can tell. I heard every word. He's talking too loud. Sign of fatigue. All that fear and exhaustion are taking a toll. They're not thinking straight. That puts us in a very precarious position. The time for negotiation is over. You know what needs to be done. Yeah. You're right. You gave those boys a chance. But now they have to lie in the bed they made. Problem is, they're keeping me and the guards in sight at all times. If we try to move against them, they'll see us coming. Mm. Make it worth my while and I'll take those guys out for you. What do you want? Credits? Fine, if that's what it takes to end this. I'll do it. 
But those credits better buy me a guarantee that the hostages will come out safe and unharmed. I was hoping money wasn't the only reason you'd undertake this risk. But I suppose it's your right to be compensated for the risk you're taking. Now, I see two ways we can play this. You could ask to see the hostages. And once you're inside, you can make your move. If you're quick, I think you can take them out before they have a chance to respond. But you'll have to shoot to kill. There's also a back door. Most of their attention's focused out front here, so they may not be watching it as closely. This key should unlock it. Hmm. I'll walk in. What the marshal say? We have a deal. No deal until I see the hostages. The marshal thinks he can dictate terms now. <laughs> Good thing for you, I'm in a generous mood. You're gonna need to ditch that weapon first. Ain't no way I'm letting you in here armed. Just hear me out for a minute. Fine, but make it quick. <laughs> what are you so worried about? You've got numbers on your side. Well, maybe. I just ain't taking any chances. This is non-negotiable. I need to know for certain those hostages are okay. Your word alone isn't good enough. Yeah? Well, I ain't got proof that you won't just start shooting if I let you in there. So I guess that makes us even. Fair point. I'm not become another hostage. This weapon is my insurance against that. Sorry. I'm not in a gambling mood. I'm done talking about this. You've got my answer, and it's final. Now go tell the marshal that I want my goddamn ship. Understandable. Have a good day. Where are you fucking going, huh? Huh? Where are you going? Where the fuck are you going? Ah! Is that, huh? Now I have two heroes, Solomon Co. and you. Good to know you're okay. Your 
searching them, make it quick. you're alive. Shame I can't take some of this from myself. Ah. Well, looks like the hostages are okay. I doubt that. I really do. Alright. Are they safe? Of course they are. It's me. Mighty confident, aren't you? Sure. Well, I've got no cause to doubt you as long as you get results. Here. You've more than earned this. You got us out of a tough spot, and you did it with courage that's not common. As a matter of fact, you might just be Free Star Ranger material. If you're interested, head on over to the Rock and ask for Emma Wilcox. She handles the new recruits. Ah. Well done. Well done indeed. Shut up. Shimon. Baby. Marco! Are you alright? They didn't hurt you, did they? It's okay. Thank goodness we have our jetpacks to offset this ridiculously heavy gravity field. Yeah. There's no one the Trackers Alliance can't find. And you're breathing? Back to normal yet? Mostly. Still feels a little you weird sipping up the way Guess you I'm did. not used to having the tube out. But it's nothing that would keep me from getting back out there. Shocking standards. Don't be well, causing trouble. Nobody now. ever accused those boys of having an over Why would I cause trouble? Akil is really the heart of the Freestar Collective. Welcome to the Rock, I guess. Stopped me from walking through your office, eh? Private? Hmm. Couldn't be me. We'll talk to that lady. than being some dust wrangler on Montara. Need something? Oh, well, hey there. Involved in a shootout. Which one? Late one night, Annie Wilcox tried to arrest me for public indecency. You got some business with me? She'll be a terror when she grows up. They ain't all real. 
I'm the hero that solved the Gal Bank hostage crisis. Really? You must have impressed the marshal. I'm guessing he wants to recruit you, so I'll tell you a little bit about who we are. Well, the Freestar Rangers ensure the safety and security of the Freestar Collective and its people. We might hunt down a fugitive, break up a smuggling operation, investigate a starship theft, or put some would-be bank robbers behind bars. Whatever needs doing to keep the people safe, we do. Hmm. Sounds like dangerous work. It can be, yeah. We tend to get called in when there's a threat too big for local security to handle. So that means we hunt the most dangerous game. I imagine you've got some questions. I'll answer anything I can. Mmm. Mmm. Is it paying work? I'll say right up front that if you're looking to get rich, this ain't the line of work for you. But, yeah, we do get paid from time to time to help with expenses and such. Is there any authority the Freestar Rangers get? Well, in theory, a Freestar Ranger can go anywhere in Freestar Collective space, uh, even private property. But of course, it doesn't always work out that way. We also have jurisdiction over any local security when we're tracking a fugitive. Hmm. All right. Okay, then. A word about myself. I'm in charge of making sure anyone that wants to be a Freestar Ranger is up to the task. That being said, the Marshal wouldn't send you here if he didn't think you had potential. So, what's it gonna be? Are you ready to sign up with the Freestar Rangers? <laughs> Given the way I had to bail him out, how about you give me the Marshal's job? If you knew half of what I did about the man, you'd show him a lot more respect. Besides, I'm next in line, and I'll be damned if I'm letting you cut ahead of me. Hmm. We'll see. How do I apply? I fill out a form or something? I prefer a more practical kind of evaluation. I'll give you the oh? details if you want to join up. Hmm. Sure. It's a dangerous job, but an important one. As long as you leave room for your commitments to Constellation, we won't have any problems. Before I hand you a badge, I need to know you can handle the job. You helped out with the hostage situation, but sometimes people just get lucky. Tell you what, use the mission terminal and take one of the listed jobs. Your choice. Come back alive, and we'll talk about you joining up. Hmm. Didn't I already prove myself at the bank? This is a dangerous line of work, and I'm not putting someone in the field unless I'm sure they're ready. <sighs> All right. Prepare to be impressed. Oh, got no lack of confidence, have you? Well, let's see if you back it up. Who the fuck are you? A year or two back, I shared a drink with Ron Hope. That man can drink. You're probably looking for Mary. I don't... What can I get you, Emma? Hiya. Oh, nothing for now. Came to talk, actually. Well, Helga says I spent too much time at my terminal. Oh, well, he's probably right. Imagine what for. Well, I know Annie's been trying to rope you into her spy schemes. <laughs> I hope it's not too much of a bother for you. Kidding? She's an angel. Truth is, she looks up to you and the marshal. Trying to keep track of the bad guys is just her way of showing that. I just hope it's not teaching her to judge people too much by the way they look. I'm sure it's just a phase. She's got a good heart and wants to protect people. Reminds me of her mother a little bit. Why, thank you, August. You won't find a better selection of brews and beverages anywhere in the Freestar Collective. Pull up a seat, friend. Hmm. Let's see what you fancy. Hmm. 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 Let's go. 
You know what? Get some pierogies and, and some booze. Yeah, let's do that. Law captain kill a gang leader destroy the crimson fleet captain at Alpha Centauri rescue a hospital these pay the most outlaw activity is at an all-time high we got a lead on a particularly notorious group last seen at the abandoned mine Hmm, another blasted outlaw gang is on the rise. We need to put them down before they become more of a problem. If you take out the outlaw gang leader, the rest of the gang should fold. Target was last seen in the abandoned mineral refinery. Prepare to be impressed. isn't exactly massed, but as seats of government go, it's still quite an impressive structure. Is there a weapon shop here? There's not enough to look at. Uh, not my kind of store. Not my kind of store. I was also told turning the crowd density to uh, um, medium solves a lot of town problems. I don't really get it. Shepherd's General Store. It's like my kind of place. Take a look around. It's a good bet I've got something you need. I want to do your business quick. The Rangers plan on dropping by for an order soon. Sure. Take a gander. Alright. What do you got? Disappointing. This thing any good? It does the exact same thing. Not gonna lie. Nothing. Nothing cool for me. Oh, I'm sure I got something cool for you.
I couldn't be more disappointed. Roland Arms. Ah, there's my gun store. Right? You be the gun store. I'm looking for something. I don't do payment plans or lines of credit, and I don't sell to shady individuals. If you can handle that, your money's welcome here. You got a lot of troublesome customers in here? More than a few, yeah. Unless you're up in the core, life around here ain't easy. Folks can find their way in all kinds of trouble. I've had no end of desperate souls come through that door in search of a way out. I know it ain't technically my fault when someone buys one of my guns and starts shooting up the town, but I still don't feel great about it. Hopefully you ain't one of those kind. Hmm. Depends on what you got. Okay. But if you start shooting up the town with something I sold you, I'll be more than a little displeased. Ah, hey, don't don't mind me. Come on. That's new. Ooh. What's the difference? Ah, you do not have what I want. What a shame. Outlaws, Ashta, those bits. I don't want to hear you getting into any trouble. Ah! All right. Back to the ship. Okay, where are we going? Do -do. Let's do it. So you gotta jump. Just isn't the same as the real thing. My name isn't Charlie. Oh, I know. Just my memory for names. Well, it's plain terrible. <laughs> Sorry. So, I'm doing my rounds, uh, pick up supply drops, and I grab into the Altair system, and <laughs> oh boy, spacers all over the damn place there. Distress call, yammering nonstop. Some big's going down there, and all of us with no skin in the game, this we just give it a wide berth. <laughs> Am I right? Hmm. What did the distress call say? Oh, it sounded bad. Real bad. But I had my own problems. I had to plot a course out before the spacers took out my grav drive. Sorry, I'm just not constitutionally capable of the big space fight. Dang. Uh. You were lucky to make it out of there. <laughs> I skidaddled as soon as my 
my grab drive could spin up, but, uh, yeah. Lucky. Bye, Charlie 3. You've been like the best Charlie 3 I've talked to all week. Okay. To the mine! We're going to the mine. Here I need to wipe out a gang leader, huh? Who's shooting? Is that me? Ah, oh. <laughs> can't be me. Can't be me. No, that's too bad. Oh God! Be up here. I see. I see the firefight. Don't you think?
go. UC survival training taught me that caves are actually quite a good way to avoid cosmic radiation or inhospitable weather. Detect current user. Remove combat inhibitors. Yeah, let's do that. Activate. Yeah, let's do that. This is an active industrial site. It would be advisable to wear a hard hat. I got this. What are you doing? I didn't stock up on junk. Hey, I had this under control. You bitch. Oh shit, 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 shit. A lot of guys here. 300 credits, my ass. 3,000 credits, my ass. So much uh Grendels and side stars, I don't care. I'm looking for the cowboy weapon. It's tipped off about the Rangers in a kill city. And uh well I still have nothing. It's a nice knife. I'm taking it. Fuck is that? Are you uh, a heat leech? What do we have over here? An ammo cache? I will take all of this. I don't even know what that was. I just took. I was ready for a knife fight, man. Sorry.
So anyways, I started blasting. No, you think we're alone? Jim. running he's running you can't run from me Corner yourself. If only I could work something out with you, no? Where are you going? Where are you going? I successfully navigated the mine. Black licorice. I did come in this way. Yeah. Oh, 
Should we search for mineral deposits while we're down here? No. No, I think we'll be okay. I think we'll be quite all right. Starting a mining operation like this takes time and patience and a hell of a lot of credits. Yep. You got that right. 